Hello and welcome back to another video on the channel everybody and today this is the second to last video of the weekend league recap series of this past weekend leagues uh, weekends weekly sorry to interrupt as you're watching this i'm streaming live over on twitch link to that is in the description this is gonna be games number uh, 16 through 20 uh, should be good games um apart from that one more thing that i would like to mention i'm thinking about starting a subscriber uh cfm for you guys that don't know it's a connected franchise online franchise where you can pick a team and then play through a seasons against a couple of buddies or in this case subscribers which i consider buddies of mine i'm gonna put, put a poll up uh just so, just so you can vote whether you're interested in that because i need i need a lot of players and i think that a lot of people are gonna enjoy it just let me know what you think about that also don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons and we're off so these are my opponent no i'm not it not these are my top three. I got Michael Vick as a golden ticket. Obviously, that's me a <laughs> weird flex, but okay. Um, and you can see that I'm not the home team in this game. I got the fire units out here. Uh, the Raiders color rush. And my opponent is going to start to pass the ball. Jeez. Jeez. I missed that attack. Anyways, down at the 25-yard line, he's passing the ball once again and throws it directly at me. Like, come on, bro. Brian Dawkins is going to make that play. Not getting out there because the running back made a very good tackle. Anyway, second and ten at my opponent's uh, 49 yard line. Let's see if I will get the time. I will. That corner was quite tight. If that was a safety, that would have been a pick. Doesn't matter. Was a completion. Great dot versus cover two, just so you guys know. Speaking of great dots, great dot to my opponent's team right there. Did you see how nicely I feathered that in there? Beautiful throw. Um, as a result of that, he, gets, he has the ball back, obviously. It's first and ten, he just chucks it up. I completely left that, but I just prayed that uh, Brian Dawkins is going to make a play for me. And he did. Not capitalizing on it, though. Uh, Punting the ball straight back to him. And now, on 3rd and 20, guess what? He gets a one-play touchdown. That was a cover 3 beater. I know that play. That is like an old-school fade rod, fade rod like we used to have in previous men's. And that's a cover 3 beater. And he just bombed me right there. Second and ten as a result. I'm starting to drive a little bit. You can see I passed let that straight up. He didn't go for the pick for some weird reason. He didn't click on. And as a result of that, we got a touchdown. He missed his, his PAT, so we're up one point. Good out of him right there. And he's getting things going a little bit. Here, third and ten. Uh, and he just masters me. I looked after this Tyreek Hill as streak specialist, so that explains it. Still frustrating to give up, you know. Once again, out here in a slot offset. going to throw the in route. I thought I was gonna get destroyed, but apparently he doesn't have um, he doesn't have enforcer on his Ed Reed. Right here, running lane is just wide open. Gonna take it for a first down inside my opponent's 10 yard line. What do I do with that? I scramble a little bit and throw it to my running back for the touchdown. Once again, up one point because he missed the PAT. Remember? Um, now second and six in my territory already. He just bounces around a couple of times and gets the first down that was really weird i hate how you can just run into your offensive line and it kind of like thumbs out the, the ai we're already in the fourth quarter i did not move the outside third that i had on the slot cornerback back far enough and he just got open man he just got open that was a good throw by him not gonna lie second and ten now once again i'm running this corner out i'm throwing the delay fade and i get absolutely my opponent gets absolutely cheated i mean they're gonna cheat somebody why not cheat my opponent that's what i'm thinking so as a, as a result of that lucky play Third and six now. I'm running this sort of weird cover two beater. It was open. I didn't throw it for some reason. I didn't throw it. I had a touchdown. I did not throw it. Ball at the 34 yard line. Still picked up the first down with the delay fit. But damn, I had a touchdown. That's that's unfortunate. Um, I he, my left tackle just got destroyed right there. And instead of having a touchdown, I fumbled the ball with 58 seconds left. That's a toughie. He doesn't get anything neither, which is good. I get the ball back. But with very little time i thought that a little bit too late but i just wanted to if i get it uh to be a long completion and then i could s spike the ball or something one second left he goes out of bounds celebrating like an asshole and yeah so that was pretty unfortunate i had the touchdown i could have tied it up but i just did not look at it it was open <laughs> it was open i just didn't take it so um that's the first loss of the video uh obviously um, now I'm playing against Mr. Koof, however you pronounce his name. Very weird. The corner was wide open. He got really unlucky right there because that that would have been a large gain. Anyways, I'm out here in U-chips this time. Information that I don't run very often. But I was like, heck, what the heck, let's just try it out. And Barry just bounces it out. I, right here, I'm spamming 
R1. Doesn't do anything, it just looks really cool. I don't get fast about it, but again, it looks cool and I care for, about those kinds of things, okay? Get off my back. He's not feeling the game and he, he just says whatever. Um, you're gonna run the ball on me. Not gonna have anyth anything to do with that. Now we're playing in uh, in New Jersey, not New York, I was about to say New York, in New Jersey in the MetLife Stadium. Not, not doing anything good. What is he doing right there? Like, just get the ball, and as a result of that, he, <laughs> he goes out of bounds, not getting anything going, but that punt was pretty sweet, not gonna lie. And it was a big mistake by him. As a result of the mistake, we get free two points. Let's go. That's that's always a good uh, thing to start off with. That was, like, not at all smart by him. Speaking of not at all smart, why did I do that? <laughs> why did I do that? I just expect to be able to outswerve him, but he just... He's not going for it, it seems like. Got absolutely rocked right there, second and ten at my 21 now as a result of that very boneheaded decision. And you see, he's got a laser. These corner knots when you roll out are really, really good. He did a good job of evading the rush, and that was just that was just wide open. I'm doing the same thing right here, getting outside of the pocket. My father just sneezed up the storm. God damn it. <laughs> Anyways, uh, the corner is wide open. At the 13 yard line now, he hesitates with, the use, with his user. I'm such an idiot. I should have high passed it. Give me the chance with the high pass. Le regular pass, Lurker is going to pick that, bro. That was that was a really boneheaded, boneheaded decision by me. Right there, also boneheaded because I just ran my cornerback, Deion Sanders, right out of the play. And as a result, he gets a touchdown. He's now up uh, two possessions, which is a tough pill to swallow, not going to lie. But what are you going to do? We're not going to complain. We're going to keep fighting. Throw that corner out. Very beautiful, if I do say so myself. Now at the seven yard line, and right here, he tries to do the same thing. I just high pass it this time and get mossed, little boy Taylor Mays. Taylor Mays got, um, got his, uh, got, damn it. Anyways, right here, he tests me, get the pick. I was trying to say that, um, Shannon Sharp put his nuts all over my guys, uh, Taylor Mays' face. Now, I got the protection down. Taylor Mace is just a little bit too slow. Also, he bites off of it. We got the cover two beaters out here. That was a very beautiful one touchdown. As a result of that, we are now only down. Wait, what? Where, where did these points come from? Anyways, he throws the corner out. Very good swear by him. Very dumb by me, actually. Not gonna lie. Um, that was pretty much a free trip into field goal range. Now he's already in the red zone. Throwing, he's got two post thrusts and he just throws it directly at the, he throws it directly at the cloud flag. That was three points, he just handed to me. He was like, I don't want this, I don't want these three points, take it. Slant is open, very open, that was like pretty uh, dumb coverage, very good stop and go. Already almost in field goal range, which is tough. He gets into the red zone, which is also not good. And whenever he gets into red zone, that's what happens. I hit stick right there with Dion Sanders, which was a very boneheaded play. Nevertheless, I, I'm still in this game, obviously. Like, this game is not at all over. And we will see. I have the one play touchdown versus a cover to a again. That was a long sentence. Got the touchdown. Missed the two point conversion, though. He throws that corner out. Man, if he doesn't get that corner out, I think the game is over. Gets that corner out. He ends up driving down the field. First and 10. That corner out is going to get open because he just sucks down uh, the cloud flat. Good play by him. Fourth and one now. This is the make or play, uh, make, uh, make or break play for me. The run is just open. Thankfully, he engaged with his user and didn't shoot through. Got the first in field goal range, but we 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 can't use a field goal at all. Like not at all. Right there. I don't get anything. Damn it! I thought I was about to get something, but Julius Peppers, he's just too fast. Fourth and eleven. As a result, that lost three yards. Fourth and eleven now. He's so fast. Uh, Patrick Willis, I'm talking about. Patrick Willis just looked so fast right there. That, that was insane. Still have three timeouts. Game is not over. Second and 16. Um, he sends out a lot of people. I sent eight at him. Got the perfect protection. Not going to lie. That was pretty frustrating. Gets the post route. Game is over. This near close flex, man. It's tough. That's why I'm going to be running it this weekend. Also, while we're at the topic of this weekend in Weekend League, Go check my weekend league stream out. This link is links in the description. Go do that. I got frozen right there. Needed to quit the game. And I got the loss for it. God damn it. Uh, I think that's the second loss that I got because of EA fuckery. So if you don't consider gameplay, obviously. But that right there was unfortunate. Playing against a Texans user. And well, for some reason, these 
it's white uniforms on white uniforms. I hate that. I hate that so much. Speaking of what I hate, I don't hate that. Very bad read, bad read by him already at the 14 yard and now at the 9. And what do we do uh, when we're in the red zone? We're scoring touchdowns, baby. Beautiful playmaker. Surprised Young onto that knock on that. That seemed like it was about to get smacked. He didn't get smacked though. Uh, fourth and 20, that is a pretty bad spot for him. Nothing is open. He just quick throws it. We knock the ball out and second and goal now. He runs some sort of man coverage. I don't know why he, why he would run man coverage. The tight end corner was also open, but that one looked even better. Just took it for a touchdown. Up 14 points now. He's out here on the left side. He has some sort of a stack look going very weird. Throws the uh, zig route just to get a positive play of him in there. Because 3rd and 18, that positivity is not going to last very long. Look at that. What a yay. I mean, they cheated him. So, yeah, I mean, they cheated me, but they also cheated him. I think that's fair game. Like, plus and minus equals nothing. I can math, I promise. So, already inside my opponent's territory. Very deep, actually. Pause. Um, first and 10 at the 28. Trying to... I thought that I could get this streak off, but I guess I can't. This baseline pressed get, uh, quarters getting back to this kind of stuff is very annoying. Also, he just breaks every tackle. Like, come on, get down, please. Takes it out all the way to the 13-yard line, 27-yard line. Now he's starting his offense. Once again, he's just running these posts. Like, why are you running the? Why are you throwing it at me? Like, I mean, this this play is not bad, but it's also not good. And you just threw it directly at me. So what the hell are you doing? Anyways, first and ten. My opponent's 13. I got the streak. He moved a quarter in then. At the snap of the ball, he clicked off of it. That makes that made it uh, break back down even slower. Got the touchdown. Third and 18, next drive. He didn't really have a chance. I celebrated right there because I wanted to taunt him. Didn't see that he was coming because he has a fucking white jersey on, and that is a very annoying glitch to face. Right here, I'm running a cover four beater. You guys know cover four beaters, they're the best because the opponent thinks, ah, oh, it's not gonna. There's no way that that's going to be beaten. Well, guess what? It is going to be beaten. Now, again, I'm on defense. He just throws it right at me again. 28-0. He, he throws it at me. These are the kinds of games that I get. I mean, come on now. Got to be better than that. Anyways, he still has not learned his lesson. He's still out here. He's still running cover four. What are you doing? You're just like torturing yourself. With this. It is that sort of like a weird kink you have. I mean, we're not going to kink shame over here. Almost fumbled that ball because... Uh, accidentally hurdled and got destroyed nevertheless he's he's had enough of this game hey sorry for screaming hey this weekend is going to be fun i'm going to go i'm going to be going for top 100 i feel like i can do it if you guys want to watch me try my ass off and cry at weekend league my link the link to my twitch is in the description i would highly encourage you to check it out it's been a lot of fun over there also played some games against viewers had some wagers a couple of days ago should be fun or it was fun it should be f fun in the future if you want to take part in that fun like i said link is in the description if you don't have twitch you should get it it's very entertaining even if you don't watch me like get twitch it's it's amazing content anyways see you in the next video hope you're having fun in weekend league as uh, to the extent that that's possible see you tomorrow and in my twitch stream goodbye